What the fuck? It came from a can. Ooh, yes it did. What do we got today, Lerofi? Today we have some of those amazing polar sardines Ooh. that they sent to us so graciously. Actually, these are herring fillets. Oh, that's even better. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I knew what I was doing. <laughs> I promise. 1.4 grams of omega-3 is for <laughs> Yes. Good for you and delicious. Healthy snack, but uh, also very good on the old taste buds. Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and crack these open and tell you what we think. What do you What do you think the uh, first can should be? Uh, definitely the regular tomato yeah, sauce, and then we'll do, move yeah. up to the hot tomato do the red sauce. Ooh. Ooh. A little bit of Le Picante. Yeah. All right. Yep. You gotta thank the Polar Company, MW Polar, for sending these out to us. Yes. We have had some very good things from them in the past, yep. and uh, we have high expectations. They fucking hooked us up this time. <laughs> yes, they did. So let's see what we got here. Ooh. Not a bad presentation. That's uh, shirt this time. Yeah, yeah no, no, we're we're not taking the top of the yeah. can off. <laughs> yeah, let's not do that again. <laughs> There's a nice big old piece of it right there, that herring fillet. That's what you want. There we go. I do want it. <laughs> hmm. The sauce is very sweet. Uh, it's kind of a sweet tomatoey sauce. And normally that's a little bit kind of, you know. Off. I don't like sweet tomatoey stuff, but in with the fish, it's really nice. I mean, I, I'm such a piece of trash. I will put ketchup <laughs> on a lot of my white fish, and here it does sort of remind me of ketchup, but it's got a little bit more flavor going on than just like a vinegary ketchup. Definitely high points on the texture. When it comes to the flavor, um, the fish holds up really good. Um, the sauce, tiny bit sweet, but you know, if if you can get down with that, I think you'll enjoy it. I do. I think it's pretty mm. darn nice. Ooh. Another deep red sauce. You can tell this one's got uh, a little bit more body to it. Okay, do. God damn it! God <laughs> damn it! It had to happen. See, now this becomes especially an issue when you've had somebody who's had a lot of heat in their life. Mm-hmm. Because then I have proper context. Me! Me! <laughs> Lies I've had the boot jalokias. I've had the brown Marubus thingies. Yeah, that one. <laughs> so if you're going to come to me and you're going to say that this is a hot product, I'm, I'm going to uh, I'm gonna fight you a bit on that. This is hot in the same way that a, like, spicy chicken from uh, Jack in the Box is hot. It's not, it's not hot. They could barely get away with calling this spicy. Mm -hmm. This, I think, should be their standard tomato sauce. Mm -hmm. um, it has a little bit of uh, seasoning to it, I would say. Here we go, Wolfie. Ha! Ah, <laughs> ha! Ah, taste my pain! <laughs> like, the, the fish is perfect. Like, I couldn't ask for a better fish out of a can. I, it is a little sweet. And in my experience from, like, making uh, tomato-based products, you have to add sugar to make it that sweet. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, that's a little weird. Maybe a little heavy-handed. Hot tomato. Maybe it's just like a really sexy tomato. <laughs> it's possible. All right, so like we got the milf, the tilf. <laughs> <laughs> I agree with Wolfie. Like that should just be their standard sauce. It does. I'm getting a little bit of that heat on the back end. If you're gonna say spicy, it should be a tad bit hotter than that. And I mean, like. These are hotter than that, and these are not hot. But both are really excellent canned fish. Keep it away from my shirt. <laughs> and pants. Damn it. As your hair dips in it. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> you got some highlights, do you, Pink? <laughs> All right, so definitely uh, they're right. The sauce is sweet. 
I, I feel like that must just be a thing that people prefer because I don't think I've ever had a tomato sauce from like canned fish that isn't that sort of sweet, um, almost SpaghettiOs sort of flavor. Saying that, I find it kind of lovely because I am a huge fan of SpaghettiOs. <laughs> I'll eat them right <laughs> out of the can. So the mix of that with the fish, to me, is pretty good. It's pretty good. Uh, like they already said, the fish is great. The texture on that fish, such a good bite. And this would be absolutely delicious on crackers. And you could add your own little dollops of Tabasco at that point. Yeah. And that would just bring it all together. Some of that sexy tomato. <laughs> that tilf. I mean, right away, it's a different sort of flavor. There's more earthiness to it, I want to say. And just a little, little prickles of like, oh yeah, there, there is something spicy in there. I'm not really sure what it is. Maybe it's just peppercorn. It's not spicy, spicy. Very, very light. Um, now... Would I say that's the preferred one? You know what? I'm gonna diff I'm gonna Oh you're not I'm going a different direction oh, here. Oh you're nuts. I Itch. actually think the sweet tomato, the plain tomato, is a better better thing. Now Okay, do you have pepper? Pepper. If you have pepper to put in the <laughs> sweet one that is going to be great, but if you do not have pepper, that is going to taste like maybe, spaghettios. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. There's just something about the sweeter one that I think I prefer. If I had pepper and the sweet one, I'd be happy. You know what you do, what you do do, what you do do. <laughs> do do. You get some of that lemon pepper. Oh, shit. And you put that. You put that on the sweet one. I didn't know uh, this was a thing that we could do. Fuck, I want to redo my review. This is yeah. how you make gourmet as fuck canned fish. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is Game Genie right here. You're cheating. <laughs> put a little bit of that lemon pepper. Yeah, that's probably going to be Ooh, really good. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. I never even thought about doing that before. I don't know why. It says genius. <laughs> Oh my, yeah. Get you some lemon pepper. Get you some <laughs> of that sweet tomato herring from M.W. Polar, and you're gonna have yourself a good time. If you can find it, like I'm not sure if M.W. Polar is a big brand around here, it's a German brand. So I would say just up, like from that, like European brands of canned fish, we mm -hmm. have found through much trial and error on this channel, way better, way They're better fantastic. than any American named uh, canned fish. So get out you, get out there, find you some MW Polar canned herring. It's delicious. Uh, I'm probably going to finish that can with some of my friend here, Lemon Pepper. Yay! This has been a came from a can. Please like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching.